Hey everyone, I'm Dr. Andrew from the National Mill Dog Rescue, and this is another episode of Medical Mondays. With me is Miss Vale, a super sweet husky who we absolutely adore at the kennel. And this week, the kennel staff noticed that she just kept squatting over and over to urinate and only producing a small amount of urine. So they went ahead and brought her to us and we took a look, did some abdominal x-rays, and we actually found some stones in her bladder. Stones in the bladder can also be called cystic calculi or urolis. It's a common thing to find in dogs, can also happen in cats. So it's something to be aware of for your personal pets. And the most common presentation is exactly what I described. They try to urinate frequently because those stones sitting in the bladder are really irritating and make them feel like they have to pee all the time. It doesn't always present that way. Sometimes they just start having accidents in the house or you might even find blood in the urine. And another thing that can occur is they can get recurrent urinary tract infections. So if you're finding yourself putting your dog on antibiotics over and over for urinary infections, it might be time to consider getting them checked to make sure there's no stones. Um, treatment does not always require surgery. We can do what's called medical dissolution where we put them on a prescription diet for at least six months and that can help actually dissolve the stones. It doesn't work for every type of stone, but the most common ones it typically does. For Miss Vale, we are gonna go ahead and do surgery for her. Since we already have to go in for her spay, we'll just do both at the same time. That will give her some more immediate relief. And we'll also keep her on the, the medical food for a number of months as well. Not every dog or cat has to stay on that prescription diet forever, but sometimes they do. Um, so those are signs to watch out for for your dog. I'm gonna go ahead and put the x-rays up right now for you guys that wanna see. So this first one, won't have any markings on it. I'll just let you guys see if you can notice the stones on your own. And now I'll go ahead and put that x-ray up that I have marked already. You can see there's one very large stone and then there's a number of small stones. So she's gonna go in for surgery tomorrow. I'm actually gonna post some of the video and pictures from surgery as well. So if you're squeamish, now would be the time to cut out and we'll see you guys next week for Medical Mondays. And thanks for tuning in.